I don't get it when others talk about hot, sexy people in a passionate way. Yeah, I, I, I really don't. Unless, like I said, unless it's my anime crushes, like I just don't get it. Salutations, witches. My name is Kiyomi Amaris from The Hextasies. And, you know, today I thought we'd do something a little different or whatever. You know, I've been talking about on this channel about my self discovery journey, my sexuality, all this and that. And, you know, I'm still trying to really figure out what my sexuality is. And if you've watched some of my other videos, you may have talked to me or. You may have heard me talk about gray sexuality, which is on the asexuality spectrum. And I thought, you know what? Let's, let's put my sexuality to the test, shall we? So I found a quiz on Quiz Expo and I will be testing, am I asexual? This free test is 100% honest with you. So let's just get right into it. Okay. Hey, am I asexual? Mm -mm. All right. Um, just a quick thing. What is asexual? Just for if anyone who's watching does not know, I'll go over this here right, right here now. An asexual person is a person who doesn't find sex an essential part of their life. Such a person might still have an act of libido. However, they're mentally okay with the idea of not experiencing sexual practice. Ooh, that's me. That's me right there. That's me. Okay. The test said I'm not sexual. In my asexual, I'm just scared. I'm dead. Should I see a doctor? Okay, let's, let's just get right into it, okay? One of 20, okay. <clears throat> I enjoy thinking about having sex. Okay, okay, wait, wait, okay, you got me here. <laughs> now, are we talking about like, you know, cause I might read me little fan fictions or whatever, or you know, think about my little, <laughs> my little tunaphilia crushes, my anime crushes and whatnot. And you know, sometimes they get a little spicy, but I'm um, talking about like actual people, no. Uh, so I'll say somewhat true. Somewhat. Okay, next one. I like to watch naked people. No. <laughs> no, I'm good. I, I don't need to see that. A perfect relationship is the one that includes no sex, only romantic activities. Okay, but I'm not romantic either. So, um, that includes no sex? No. A perfect relationship is the one that includes no no I don't I don't believe in that necessarily no I might have sex with my partner only if they ask for it see okay I don't I don't know I didn't know how to navigate this even in my last relationship to be quite honest with you so I don't really know I don't really know I might have sex with my partner only if they ask for it so if they were to ask me for sex, I might indulge. Cause you want to like do a little song, you know, get me going or whatever. Um, somewhat true, I guess. I don't know. You know, <laughs> I'm sure that I don't need to have sex. That is absolutely true. I, you know, it's just not that important to me. Sex is only told to make babies. No, I do think, you know, sex is intimacy and yada, 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 whatever. I don't get it when others talk about hot, sexy people in a passionate way. Yeah, I, I, I really don't. Unless, like I said, unless it's my anime crushes, like, I just don't get it. Like, if it's, <laughs> it's like real people, like celebrities, I just, you know, not my thing. Sex is an unnecessary part of life. For me, yes. For everyone, no. So I'll just say something true. Because for me, yeah, I don't really care about it that much. Unless with my 2D men. 
Have I specified that yet? I wonder why I need to touch someone else's body for pleasure. Why do I need to touch someone else's body for pleasure? Do I wonder about that? I wonder why I need to touch someone else's body for pleasure. You don't need to touch anyone else's body. You, it's your own body. The what? Um, I don't really. This one's a little iffy for me. Okay, I do masturbate occasionally. Occasionally, yeah. Not, not very often. Sometimes I think about sex, but I don't feel the need to experience it. Oh, absolutely. Abs. I'm right there. I'm right there. Oh my god. This. Okay. This. This quiz is reading me. I don't know. I wouldn't mind if my partner never wanted to have sex with me. I'd still love them. Okay, so here's the tricky part about this one, right? <laughs> here's where I might have an issue. If my partner never wanted to have sex with me, okay, it depends. If they're asexual, I get it. But if they're actually a, a, a sexual person and they don't want to have sex with me, that's gonna make me feel like, okay, What's wrong with me? Am I, am I physically not good enough or whatnot? That's why I say I'm, I'm gray sexual because I still want to experience something, but like, it's just not my everything. Um, I wouldn't mind my picture if my partner never wanted to have sex with me. So I guess if I was dating an asexual person, like full ace, I wouldn't mind if they never wanted to have sex with me. If I was dating an ace person, then yeah. I say somewhat true. Like a, it, it depends. It depends. All of these are very situational. I'm not sex, sexually attracted to anyone. Not sexually attracted to anyone. I can be, but it's not very strong. Unless maybe I just haven't met someone that just like really like gets my gears going or whatever, you know. But um, I'll say somewhat true. I might have sex with someone who I love, even if I don't enjoy it. Then what's the point? What's the point? What's the point? So if I love someone, would I have sex with them even if I don't enjoy it? No, honestly. I'm too selfish like that. If I'm not into it, if I'm, if I'm not into it, it, it's just not a good time for either one of us, you know? I find it hard to imagine having sex and enjoying it. Okay, here's the thing again. <laughs> here's to ting again, right? Um. So when I imagine me with my 2D crushes, right? I'm like, oh yeah, this is it. I am enjoying it 100%. But if I'm imagining like sex I IRL, it is kind of hard for me to imagine it just because it's just not that pleasurable. I don't know if I just haven't found that partner yet. Like I said, that really gets me going. I don't know. But I will say somewhat true. I don't hate sex. I just need to get to know someone before wanting to sleep with them. I'll say that's somewhat, tr that's somewhat true. I don't hate sex. But I like to know, know them to some degree, you know? I never asked my partner for sex. I don't think I need it at all. I never? I never asked my partner? I don't think I need it. No, I, I need to at least experience it. At least once, maybe a few times, you know, whatever, we'll see if it's really for me or not. So I'll say false for this one. What? I know. I don't want to have sex. It's a decision. I don't want to have sex. It's a decision. It is a decision. It is a decision if you don't want to have sex, right? Is, it, is, that, is that what this is asking? Nineteen of twenty. We're almost there. <clears throat> sex is like food. We need it to, to survive, but we don't have to love its taste. Oh, oh. Do we need it to serve? No, pure survival. I mean, as the human race, yes. But like, as my soul person surviving, I just need food, water, shelter, clothes. Um, I don't need sex. I'll say false. Like I said, the human race in general, yes, but as me as a whole, like just me, my person, my body, no, I don't need it to survive. It's 
you know? If I died right now and I never had sex again, I that would not be on my regret list if I were to die, you know? Um, sex is an overrated concept. Yes, I agree with this 100%. It is so, it's just everywhere in, in rap songs, freaking just everything's over sexualized. All my friends, which I, I love you friends, I love you, you know? Um, like all my friends always talk about sex and how they need it and they have it. And like, they don't, uh, if they don't have sex for like a month, a week even, they're like, you know, they're they're going through a, <laughs> they're like twitching and shaking, like they're going through a what? withdrawal or something. Um, but I personally think it is so overrated, but that's just me. All right, <gasps> you might be asexual, I knew it. Based, oh, uh, nothing. Based on your answers, there's a chance that you are an asexual or non-sexual person. People like you don't find it necessary to have sex. You also seem to have no strong sexual attraction to other people, unless it's 2D. <laughs> that's that's not the story. Oh, nothing in my. Oh. -ho. You also seem to have no strong sexual attraction to other people, but keep in mind that asexuality is not a choice and it is a sexual orientation. I think it's my orientation. I'm figuring myself out, y'all. So there's nothing to worry about. Many asexual individuals have normal lives and even engage in romantic relationships. <gasps> snap it up, snap it up. Okay. Um, wow. Okay, that, that was a quick quiz. You know, I still. Okay, I, I, I. You know what, baby? Time for a bring me in, babe. Honestly, I personally think no, no. Reverse that. I personally believe that I am on the asexuality spectrum. I think I stand with gray sexual because it's like. It's, you know, black, white, gray. There's different shades of gray, but like, I don't know. I just don't care about sex as much as other people. And like I said, everyone always talks about it. And I personally think it's so overrated, but maybe it's because I haven't had good sex yet, not calling out my ex or whatever, but kind of. <laughs> but you know, that's what my friends tell me. They're like, maybe you just haven't had good sex yet. But my thing is, If that were true, wouldn't I, like, wouldn't I have the urge to go out and experience it then? Because I don't even care to, to go out and try to experience that. Like I said, if I were to die and I, if I were to die right now, or in the future, and I never had sex again, I honestly wouldn't care. So... They might be right, you know, maybe I just don't crave it because I had never had that strong of sexual desire or never had good sex to make me want it. But I still don't have that desire to even go out and even experience good sex. So I don't know, I, I just, it is what it is. And in my most recent uh, reaction to my old story time. I talked about how I'm not a very sexual person. Um, me from seven years ago even said that. And I think that just really confirmed it for me now in, in, in 2022. Because I didn't think I, I knew that about myself, but I did, I always have. So I, I think this just really confirmed it for me. I don't know, but it's just a test. It's all it's all in fun, all in fun, but the I got the results. I I you know I think it's safe to say. I think it's safe to say. Anywho, this was just a short little quick video with a vote just for fun. Uh you get on Quiz Expo and you take this test. Let me know what results you guys get. Anywho, <laughs> I'ma head out now. Thank you so much for just watching. You know, it's all in fun. All in fun. So it is what it is. But I will see you next time, witches, hexes, goblins, and ghouls.
Bye.